back again with another music video reaction. My name is Josh. Thanks for checking out the channel. If you click the thumbnail, you probably know more about this artist than I do because I was recommended to check this one out and I'm going in blind. And today we are checking out Dimas Sinopati. Very sorry if I'm saying this name wrong. I was recommended to check him out by some of the commenters and you guys said that I probably would like his style based on some of the other songs that I've reacted to and how I've reacted to them. So I'm not exactly sure what his style is going to be. He does appear to be doing some covers, which I always really enjoy because I just really like seeing people do songs that I'm familiar with, but also in their own style. It's kind of a good introduction to new artists. But you guys recommended, since I do and I am a fan of Avenged Sevenfold, that's one of my more favorite kind of metal bands growing up. If Metal, hard rock, I don't know what you even consider Avenged Sevenfold at this point, but this is so far away and it's an acoustic cover, so I'm thinking we're going a little softer maybe? I don't know, but we figure we're going to go ahead and give it a shot. I've been so surprised and happy with a lot of the people that you guys have recommended, so I'm definitely down for this one. All right, let's get it. Never fear for anything, never shame but never free, a life to heal the broken heart with all that is. Live a life so endlessly So beyond one other sea I try to heal your broken heart With all that I could Will you stay? Will you stay away forever? How do I live without the ones I love? Time still turns the pages of the book gates burn in time always on my mind I have so much to say but you're so far away plains of water futures home foolish slice of growing old it seems we're so invincible the truth is so cold a final song a last request Perfect chapter lay the rest Now and then I try to find A place in my mind Where you can stay You can stay away forever How do I live without the ones I love? Time still turns the pages of the book It's burned Place in time on my mind I have so much to say but you're so far away sleep tight I'm not afraid the ones that we love are here with me lay away a place for me cause as soon as I'm Bit of that rasp going on. in time always on my mind and the light you left remains but it's so hard to stay when I have so much to say but you're so far away
So, Dimas, that was pretty freaking fantastic. Okay, so, that was not exactly what I was expecting. I guess I didn't really know what to expect. His voice is so different than the lead singer from Avenged Sevenfold, at least for the most part. He has such a, a little bit higher pitched voice, but the song was so beautiful. But it was a very much so like his own version of it, even though the guitar, the acoustic guitar, by the way, was fantastic, whoever that was playing. Nice job. But the vocals were so pleasant and so easy to follow. Like, honestly, I've listened to that song a lot, and I've heard a lot of Avenged Sevenfold, and I don't really know that I've fully understood or listened to all the actual words before. <laughs> as bad as that is. A lot of the times, especially as I was younger, I just listen to things, and I pick up the chorus, and then you just kind of get the, the heavy metal stuff going or whatever, even though this is a softer song. But that's a sad song. I did know that one was sad, but I really got to feel it a lot more in this one and in his version. Again, very, very different, but he's got such a good twist on it with his unique vocals that are so kind of just on point. But then he was able to pull out a little of that raspiness coming towards the end in certain parts. And I was like, okay, that's a little more Avenged Sevenfold style of, you know, that lead singer he's got. I don't know how he's kept singing all the years that he has because it just sounds like that growl that he's got going on would just tear apart your vocal cords. But this guy was really, really good. He also seems really young. Granted, I'm pretty bad at predicting people's ages based off of looks and things like that. But seems pretty young, but also sings beautifully. So let me know more about him. Like, I don't know where he's from. Also, actually, how to pronounce his name would be helpful. And then what else I need to check out? Because if he's doing some rock stuff like this, especially some 90s, early 2000s, maybe even some 80s rock in there, uh, I'm definitely going to be checking that out because that's my wheelhouse. That's right in the wheelhouse. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe. Go to the subscribe button if you would. That'd be fantastic. And as always, you're awesome. Peace out.